Hello everybody, I see Sawyer here, and I didn't expect to be making another one of these little videos for this mod yet. But guess what took multiple days to fucking get approved? Anyway. <laughs> so yeah, this is my new SCP Labels mod thing. It's it's out now, it's finally out. There will be a link in the description if you don't for those who don't want to go back and check. I'm just making this video. I was gonna do like a FNAF thing, but I need to gripe for a minute about how fucking annoying it was to get this out. So, every time I put up the mod, it would say, hey, you need to change this, this, and this about the description to be approved. I was like, okay. And then I realized that literally everything that wanted me to change is what's in a normal mod description. Like, one of them said... You can't have video links in your mod description. Just, what the fuck? Who doesn't have a mod tutorial link in the description? I mean, other than, you know, people who aren't YouTubers who make mods. But, you know. A lot of them tend to have that. There's a very good reason for it. There's so many, so many stupid things that they kept saying, like... One of them said... You can't have personal stories in your mod description. So. Where is the personal story? Because I just talk about how this... The only things that I had in the description that would be a personal story would be me talking about how the other mod exists and this was made for it. It just... It irritated me so much. There are so many stupid things I kept saying. One of them was like... Uh, what was it? You can't have... Oh, yeah, this one really annoyed me. You can't have a tutorial in the description. Like, a written-out tutorial. Because I had a written-out tutorial originally in the description. I how the fuck to use the mod. It was, like, two words, like, Hey, stick thing in stone cutter. Get thing out. Done. That's all. That's kind of all the mod does, is you stick thing in stone cutter. You get these out. Boom. Done. They're customizable. You can do more with them. There's got to be more done with them. Also, for some reason, someone commented, Hey, you should change the thing to be a square. Um, if you're talking, if you're there, for the, for the one who was asking that, I do, I do want to point out, this diamond here actually has a reason to exist. Uh, the rest of those blanks, blank spots are going to be filled in with other symbols that you're going to be able to add. To uh, spruce up and further customize your labels. Because labels aren't fully done yet. It's taking a while to get said symbols in there. <laughs> For a very good reason. They're kind of complex. <laughs> I do have one batch of them done. And they're going to be rolling out soon. I just need to change numbers and shit. And do a few other things. In order to get all of them in. And I'm also going to be adding more labels. Because, well... I have more labels to add. I have more SCPs in my mod coming up. And I have a few labels that I want to add for SCPs that I'm never going to be able to actually physically make. For one reason or another. So instead, I'm just going to fucking make the label, make its number, and boom! It'll be in the label one. For those who want to, you know, roleplay with it and shit. Because that is like a main thing that I think of is, would this be good for, like, a roleplay if people are using it for, like, a server? Because that's what a lot of those servers do, is they, you know, take the SCPs and they roleplay with them. Which is really cool. And I love that. And I want them to come back, because that's actually really fun. I used to take part in some of those. They were very fun. Anyway. Uh, what else is there? Yeah, apart from the annoyance of putting this on the Curse Forge. Um, yeah, that's about it. So, um, yeah, mod is out. It's in, link, link is in the description. It pairs, of course, directly with my SCP mod. Because, well, it, it's just a feature from, from my SCP mod that I kind of ported over <laughs> into another mod so that I could actually, you know, have it and not have it take up so much space in my other mod. Because the other mod is going to be very full as I add more and more SCPs. 
It's already getting a lot fuller because of the SCPs I'm working on. And there's actually one I'm developing right now that's going to be very highly anticipated. And I'm finally working on some more dangerous SCPs, so the uh, mod is actually going to be deadly. <laughs> and containment breaches will be possible. Hopefully. Maybe. If it works. <laughs> but yeah. Everyone has enjoyed. If you should join the ranks of the SCP Foundation, don't forget to shoot the like button, so leave those comments, and contain the subscribe button. And we got those same next video, live stream, right over next. Peace, guys.